When Mount Vesuvius erupted in 79 AD, Pompeii in Italy was buried with rocks and ash. Scientists and politicians say Kilauea is nothing like that. It is a gentle, shield volcano. The people of Pompeii did not have the level of science and the foresight to realize the outcome. Today, there is advanced science in hand, but also complacency. The Earth exhibits both transient and slow transformation processes shaping its future. This recent time-lapse video shows that the crater floor is growing upwards. Lava from beneath the crater floor is lifting the surface. In addition, lava flows over the floor also contribute to growth. The crater floor has risen and subsided many times in the past, often ejecting lava. To understand what is happening at Kilauea, Mauna Loa, and the island of Hawaii, you have to look at a cross-section of the Earth below the Pacific Ocean. Kilauea started forming underwater about 280,000 years ago. We need to go further back in time to get the big picture. According to current science, the upper portions of the Earth are made of moving tectonic plates and layers over a central hot magma core. Chains of volcanoes occur when moving plates, Earth's crusts, intersect with other plates or continents, example, ring of fire. Some chains of volcanoes occur within the interior of plates rather than at intersections with other plates. This happens when there is a large plume of hot lava rising from deep within the Earth. This is referred to as a hotspot. A line of volcanoes develops as the plate moves over the hotspot. This is the case with the Pacific plate over which Hawaiian islands have been formed. Over the past 70 million years, the combined processes of magma formation, volcano eruption and growth, and continued movement of the Pacific plate over the Hawaiian hotspot have left a chain of volcanoes across the Pacific Ocean floor. The volcanoes are progressively older away from the largest and most active volcano. The Hawaiian Islands are a very small part of the chain and are the youngest islands in the mostly submerged mountain chain composed of more than 80 volcanoes. This map shows the trail of these submerged islands or volcanoes. It is inevitable that the Kilauea and Mauna Loa eruptions will continue to add additional lava on top of the island in unpredictable ways. This added weight will continue to sink the island into the softer ocean layer. The combined effect of added weight, soil erosion and sea level rise due to climate change will result in a fully submerged atoll of what was formerly the island of Hawaii.